Hey, welcome back. This is Tony and you're on the woodshed. Let's jump into it real quick here. Real quick as I'm searching for the button to push. Hey, I know it's here somewhere. There we go. All right, so this is where I left off. I would never remember it except for when I turned the game on. Here I was. So I was going to show you what was down here. I think we went down here. Oh, we went down here last time. And uh, it looked like I left myself clues that something is down here because I wouldn't have put up this gate if there wasn't something that I was afraid to come and get me. <laughs> Anyway, oh yeah, you know, while I'm here, let me get some of this. Yeah, I got my iron pickaxe. I know you don't want to see me. Oops. Oops. Well, that's not good. Okay. I'm going to say, I know you don't want to see me uh, struggle with a stone pickaxe. I can plug up that hole now. Come over here, come over here. All right, let's see if we can find that hole. Come on, come on. I know you're here somewhere. There we go. Oh, heck, that's where the good stuff was. Too. Did I plug it? Looks like I did. All right, well, we'll have to avoid that. Give me some more light. Anyway, the heck you say? How about over here? Can I get this one? Okay. All right, I will just leave that alone. I will just leave that alone. Come on, let's go forward. Well, I tell you, that's no way to start the day. Anyway, oh, I'm almost out of torches. My name's Tony, and I'm on the woodshed. If you want some more information about my server, go to LostTreasureHuntGame.com. Anyway, we're going to see what was going on here. Why did I stop and put it up for crying out loud? It's just nothing but water up here. Okay, we're not going to do this. We're not going to do this. We have to go a different way. We're going to go a different way. Let's try over here. Yep, the woodshed, that's my server. And um, at the lost treasure hunt game .com is where you'll find out about the little game I created. It's a uh, treasure hunting game. You use coordinates in Minecraft and on a grid map to uh, find the treasure. There's lots of treasure. Or you can just play Minecraft. Because Woodshed is a vanilla Minecraft with uh, flaming turned on and it's in um, survival mode. Some of the videos you'll see me in creative mode because I'm trying to do something special. Show you something special. Look at the last few episodes. You'll see it some kind of fun stuff. I think it's fun anyway with the uh, villagers. Villages, I go into the village and I'll try to help them prosper, help them grow, help them up the ply. Kind of fun. Especially, it's, more, it's especially, especially fun. Boy, I can't talk today. It's especially fun when, let's see, how high am I? Uh, 28. When I find a, a village that isn't doing so well might have one or just two villagers in it. I enjoy, you know, making that village turn into something more. Okay, so now I'm out of torches. I need more torches. There we go. Now let's see. Where am I? Where was I? Oh yeah, that's too bad I couldn't get that. It's over here.
uh, let me just go to the other direction here. I believe there's so much, much water here. the opposite of good. Oh, well. Where was I? I couldn't tell up from down. Yeah, that's not good. Let's go down and see what I did to my tunnel. That quest for iron ore got me in trouble there. I know I saw some more iron there. Oh. That's no good. Let's go up a little bit higher, see what happens. Fire's not good either. I guess the clue should be that there's an octopus. <laughs> it's not just a little stream. I'm underwater, it looks like. Way under. I can't go that way, and I... Did I, did I run into water over here? Shouldn't have. This is way up now. Okay, for some reason I just wanted to change direction. I'll come back up here. Maybe it's safer to go down from here. Yep, an octopus? That tells me that it's just not a little creek. Yeah, you see octopus in, in rivers, I think. I think they're there. They think they're everywhere. There's gold there. Come on. And there's the octopus. Ooh, hello, guy. I want that gold. We gotta figure this out. We have to figure this out. Alright, jump in there and get that gold. Okay, so what's in here? a lot of water. Oh, it stops there though. We're good. We're good. Just 
work our way over there. How deep are we here? Uh, or is it 20? You're a bad guy. I know you're out there somewhere. Here you are. You're a bad guy. Must be something good over here that you're hiding. Something I want, maybe. What do you think? the other guy. Where are you? Be up high. Oh, there's two of them. That's trouble. They're fighting each other. Get it over with. Get it over with, you guys. That's right. Battle to the end. Good for you. Yeah, good for you. Kill your buddy, then you just get killed. That's the best way to do it. And why do they do that? Why do they fight each other? I guess that could be said for the whole world, right? Why do we fight each other? <laughs> Something about that. Just gotta fight. Oh, it's one of those guys. I stay away from those guys. They don't hurt you. If you don't hurt them, they won't hurt you. That's that's a good philosophy. Oh, that's an exploding guy. Can I hit you with a rock? I don't see anything worth digging up over here anyway. Alright, dude. Oh, you're not supposed to make eye contact with those. That's right. Oh, shit. He's going crazy. Oh, yeah. You're not supposed to make eye contact with those guys. Now I'm made trouble. There. Boom. Coming to get you. How's that? Yeah. Smart. Alright. We won't do that again. Alright. I still hear him. I wonder if he's going to follow me up here. Yeah, that doesn't sound good at all. <laughs> what did I do? What did I do? <laughs> anyway. Again, this is Tony. I'm on a woodshed. It's a little slideshow that I show every once in a while. These are... Uh, some custom builds that are on my server. If you want the information on how to get to the server, go to losttreasurehuntgame.com. Got these um, about three or four builders. I hired three or four builders last year, and they built some really cool stuff. It's on my server. There's a bunch of them out there. Come, up, come and join us. Have some fun. Just have some regular Minecraft fun or play the game, Lost Treasure Hunt game. Uh, Lost Treasure Hunt game is... Uh, 
coordinates game, and you just uh, use a um, grid map and some coordinates to find the treasure. It's treasure all over the all over the game. And these unique builds. There's a Japanese township, Italian piazza, medieval village. Right there is a Mountain View castle. Uh, it's a jungle temple. Some are just builds, like a large building, or like this. Others are just a complete map. Lots of buildings on it. A lot of fun. They're all occupiable. Come down and have some fun on the Minecraft server. Treasurehuntgame.com. Here's a little bit of information. Hey, I want to thank. Um, I want to thank everyone who has subscribed to my um, my YouTube. Exciting to see that number go up. I want to thank you very much. Uh, welcome to uh, anyone on Patreon. Patreon, who is going to uh, help me. <laughs> Just throw a little love. Throw a little love my way. But um, for all of you on uh, uh, Patreon, uh, or thinking about subscribing, just uh, just throw a dollar. Just throw a dollar my way. That's that's good enough. Just looking for a way to have fun here and uh, you know pay for the server itself. It's a, I, I'm on uh, Apex hosting servers. They're great folks. They're great folks. They've been very helpful. Whenever I run into trouble, which is often, um, they uh, they have an answer for me within hours. And that in itself is very helpful because I have a pretty busy schedule. I like to uh, get the problem fixed and move on. But um, so everyone at Patreon, love it. Uh, if you would uh, help out a little bit. Uh, LastTreasureHuntGame.com uh, is a game that I have uh, on this Minecraft server. What you do is um, there's a set of coordinates, there's lots of coordinates, but you take a set of coordinates and put it on a grid map, draw an X marks the spot, and then journey to the uh, to the treasure. Uh, most of the treasure is buried, but some is in plain sight. Um, but uh, I mean that's part of Minecraft is the journey. That's the fun I think of Minecraft um, of survival mode is that it's the journey and seeing some you know cool locations and then battling uh, with the bad guys um, and then finding that treasure. So come and join me. But we're gonna get right back to the action here. Let's see where was I? Was I? Did I just get? I just got blown up, didn't I? Now let's get back here. Gotta push the right buttons. That's part of the journey, pushing the right buttons. <laughs> All right, let's get back to it. I think of the different areas, there was only one of about four or five that weren't flooded out. Uh, so that's flooded out, I think. Yep, that's flooded out. And that was flooded out. And this is the only one. And I did find water. That's right. I came up. And then I decided that, oh, yes, we'll come down instead of going up and running into water. And I came down here. And there's lots of bad guys down here. That's right. Oh, and here they come. Swords here, and we have three. They're just hiding. Come on. Come on. I know you're there. Come on, don't be shy. Oops. 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 <laughs> I was going to say, don't be shy. Okay. What do I have to do to get you closer? Where the heck they go? I know, I just saw you. There you are. Yeah, there you go. Come on. Here, get some of that. There you go, get some of that. Where's your brother at? There he is. Why are you shaking? Oh, that's weird. I've never seen one turn into one of those guys before. They start shaking. You know what? That's a lot like a TV show that we're watching on Netflix. I can't think of the title, but, but when I tell you, when... People are about to die, and they start screaming. Travelers, that's what it's called, travelers. They turn into somebody else. Coming from the future. It's been a fun show.
Oh boy, two at once. Oh, 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 oh. There you go. You know, there's no way to recover the gunpowder when you guys blow up in water. You're not helping me at all. What's that? Ink sack. I'm sure there's some use for that, but I don't want it right now. Just throw it back out there. Glowing ink sack. When your ink sack starts to glow, that means that you've got something the doctor can't cure, I think. That's right. Thumbs up, subscribe, and join my Discord. Hey, on the Discord, uh, if you've been watching, some of the, cut, the some of the builds that I do, which aren't that great necessarily but uh, they're for free you can uh, download them on my discord these are builds that um, I put in villages to help the villagers um, help the villages grow uh, just go take a look at some previous episodes you'll see what I'm talking about but those builds are on um, on my Discord. What am I doing? I'm trying to find the right button. Oh, I'm out of um. That's the problem. I am out of. Uh, I guess I'm not there. Some right there. Oh, there's some iron ore. Gotta go. Gotta get that. Gotta get that iron ore. Is that a bat down there? Why is he down there? Oh, and again, I want to say, I can never say it enough. Thank you for subscribing to my YouTube channel. Probably wondering, why is this old guy playing Minecraft? I'll have to blame it on the grandkids. My wife's got 12 grandkids. And last year, six of the 12 got us involved in playing this game, and I just can't stop. <laughs> They're great kids, but boy, they got me into trouble here. Just playing. Playing a game. I saw them. They were talking about it quite a bit over the course of a couple of visits out there to them. And so finally I said, you know, what is this uh, Minecraft thing that you've been talking about? And they told us about it, and then we got our accounts so that we could play them. Which is kind of cool as it turned out, because it's, it, it's the video games are a great way to bridge the distance gap. And in our case, the generational gap. And it, it really turned out to be a cool thing because when kids are teaching adults something that they do, that they like, and obviously the adults have to be interested, it really changes the, di the dynamic. And the kids... Um, they become so, oh, they change. They, they kind of, they're not afraid to, uh, to talk and tell you things. They feel confident. That's, that's what I'm thinking. I'm gonna say is that they, they become so confident once they're, they feel like they're teaching the old folks something, right? <laughs> and they are, I mean, they are. They really did teach me something here. I really enjoyed this so much that, you know, I have my own server now and that's super complicated to keep that thing running um, only because I'm just that's not where my head is all the time is in that kind of technology I love technology and everything about computers I love but setting up a server was a lot different than anything I've ever done and um, I like to exercise my brain like that kind of like you know Sudoku right <laughs> A lot of people play Sudoku to keep their minds active, but I like um, learning new technology. I'm 
trying to think of something that I've done in the past that's similar to, you know, how it really makes you understand how things get, are connected. But, uh, I can't think of anything that's exactly the same. Uh, before the grandkids got me involved in... Uh-oh. I gotta, gotta get rid of some junk here. Let's go back down here for a second. Oh, look at that. Hey, are you my neighbor? Are you here to ask for a cup of sugar? How's that? Oh, one more. Come on. You, um... Are you stuck? Are you stuck? Here, do you need me to give you a hand? Uh, like, you're nodding your head. I think that's yes. Here you go. Here, grab a hold. Grab a hold. Oh, you missed me. All right, grab tight. Oh, uh, no, a little tighter. A little tighter. Oh, yeah, you got it. Now you're good. Anyway, forgot where I was. What was I talking about? The uh, grandkids gaining so much confidence in teaching us stuff. Oh, yeah, I can't think of anything that I've done that's just really as complicated as setting up a server. Um, that doesn't mean that it would be difficult for anybody else. It's just me. I have a lot of interests. Uh, photography. Uh, a little bit of filmmaking from college days. That kind of stuff. Ham radio. I've got my ham radio license. That was that was a great hobby. That's at the time that was like one of the best hobbies I've ever had. I was able to talk to people all all over the world from my little radio shack in the lower level of the home. And uh, it was amazing how little energy, elect um, electrical energy, it takes to speak to someone on the other side of the planet. Oops, 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 oops. Come on, get up there. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Plug it up. Plug it up. Oh, there's water everywhere. Yep, ham radio was a crazy fun hobby. Is the water still coming or is it just okay it's taking a long time. Maybe that's not water maybe that's like oil or something why is it taking so long? Oh that's what I was gonna say just before the uh, grandkids got us involved in Minecraft. I was teaching myself um, Blender. If you know, Blender is a uh, three-dimensional graphics program, and that's amazing. To build things in that and be able to walk around inside them, and yeah, kind of like you do in Minecraft. You know, I was playing um, Second Life or Minecraft. And it's exactly like that in Second Life here. You're building places, you're building things, and meeting people, and going inside your buildings, and driving cars around and stuff. Boats, ships. <laughs> Jeez. It's just amazing what people do in computer games. So, having the username Grandpa Tony, that kind of tells you that I'm a. Uh, A little mature, <laughs> not quite mature, I guess. I'm not, I'm not immature, but I'm not quite mature. Uh, older guy, and I remember when video games were like Pong, where literally you're just, you're playing tennis with a dot on the screen, and that was exciting. That was a like brand new back then. It was a very interesting thing. What's that? Where's that coming from? Get over there. 
Oh, go, 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 oh. I guess I can't. Yes, I can. Oh, I can't. What's the secret here? Am I just going to bop up and down? Um, so, what's the deal? Am I stuck here? Must be on a brick. Up. There we go. And I've lost my direction. Am I coming? Am I going? Oh, there I am. Good. Oh. Good job. There we go. Back at the hideout. This is the hideout. You know what I haven't done lately? I haven't gone up to the garden. What do you got up here? Oh, you got some carrots. Let's get rid of some blocks. And I'll garden a little bit here. I don't need all that. I don't need all that dirt. What else? Oops. What else you got here? You don't need this stuff. Got one little piece of gold. It's too bad. I think that's because it was. I think it's because that water started to come out and I wasn't able to get the rest of it. Of course, if I could remember where that was, I could go up higher and maybe come down and get the gold, but I don't remember where it was now. I don't know why I'm collecting all this. I don't need it for anything. I could eat it, I suppose. Carrots are tasty. I like carrots in real life. Alright, so... Oh, look at that. I'll take some of that. Of course, I have to go down and get it once it falls. Hmm. Hmm. Let's do it this way. Let's go between them. Right about there. And let's give ourselves a little walkway. I still have more st stone that I really need. Alright, this is the way. This is the way. Let me show you the way. This is it. I wish I could have found more um, iron ore on this episode. for iron. Stop going up there. Look at that, huh? It's daylight out. If you remember from a previous episode, I dug, I put a plant, I put a garden up here and then I had to dig the coal upward to get some sunlight. Let's go up there. Let's go. Let's get out of here for a minute before it gets dark out. Uh oh, I think it's getting dark out. No, no. That sunset or sunrise come in. Okay, so this is near. I believe this is near that. Um, that horse. Look at that. I think this is near that village that had no villagers in it, and I brought villagers over from the other side of the mountain. So which side am I on here? Hmm. It's the other way. Over there.
Yeah, yeah, this is the, uh, this is the one. Yeah, see this, this was a cool village. It's got like three or four levels. And when I first found it, I think there were like two villages, villagers. Oh good, they're working in this one now. I haven't seen them work in this, in this garden. But I think there were just two villagers. And then while I was creating those little farms here and putting beds in all their 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 um, homes, then I think it was we were down to one villager. So then, in this mountain here, yeah, this mountain here divides it is uh, separates this village from another village on the other side and that one had a lot of villagers a lot i don't remember making this bridge across did somebody else come into the game and start start building stuff over here uh, uh, hi guys remember me yeah that's right it's me again oh let's see do i need some wool or do i need some Oh, I might need some more food while I'm here. What the hay? You don't mind if I take a couple of sheep, do you? Just a couple. All right, that's good. Am I out of my way? Why didn't I pick up that? I'm not full again. Oh, crying out loud. Let me get rid of something quickly before that. And watch out, dude. Get rid of, uh, get rid of this. Okay. I don't use that for anything anyway. Okay. Did I lose it already? Nope. There it is. There we go. One more. What do you got left here? One, two, three, four, about six. That's not bad. Oh, and I did just happen to garden some wheat, so let me just feed you guys. You can make a few more little babies. There you go. Hello, fellas. All right, that's enough of that. Anyway, this is the village that had like one, it was down to one villager, and now look at it. <laughs> I, get, <laughs> I love it when you, you, you get them going, and there's so many villagers, it's so noisy. <laughs> yeah, amazing. What are you all excited about? Yeah, what you got? I don't have anything. I, but I was playing the grandkids. I had a village going that was so big that I didn't have to mine for anything. I could just buy it. I could trade, buy it, buy and trade with the uh, with the miners or with the uh, villagers. Didn't have to dig. Oh, what's going on here, huh? Oh, okay. Oh, look at that. Did I catch that? Did I catch that on uh, video? They've made a, another villager. That's how it works. You, you, you get all the stuff that they like, and they just start making villagers. What a world, huh? I have some seed. Let me just, oh, since I'm here, let me just give you, help you with your your gardening. I could probably use this stuff. Next time I come, I might need some. There we go. And you know what? I was... Why did I... Ch I chopped a bunch of this down with some um, sugar cane because I used it somewhere. 
Maybe I planted it somewhere. Maybe that's it. What do you think of this shader? You guys send me a uh, send me a, um, a message. Oh, what do you think of this shader? Is nice. I like the clouds. The clouds look nice. The light looks real natural. I mean, as natural as a video game. What's going on here? Okay, let's see if we get this. Oh, did I distribute? Oh, sorry. Did you, were you looking for a little privacy? Uh, Sorry about uh, that, dude. Alright. Alright. And I always... I forget to look up what... How do you pronounce the name of those robots? That's, um... When I saw that they had arrived, I realized that, uh... This village was gonna survive. That's that's a sure sign that you got the village healthy enough. Everyone going to bed? This was like my uh, Minecraft hilt in here. No one's in these rooms. Though. Dude. Just you and, and all this. This is like a double double king size bed, all to yourself, almost. Oh well. <laughs> oh hey, you know what? Let's go down there and see what was down there. What are you doing in a room? You guys don't. You don't sleep in rooms. Let's go down. Okay, now I forget where this. Yeah, let's go down and see what's down here. I've kind of completely forgotten. What I was doing down here. I think I was. Oh! I must have been setting this up for another set of rooms. Oh. Huh. Well, let's see. That, that, yeah, uh, that's what I was doing, and something must have interrupted me, and I stopped. Well, I thought maybe this was like going a tunnel going down to more treasure. Guess not. Uh -huh. Well, oh, it was <laughs> the robot. So he's so bright. I thought it was that was daylight. I thought I was going outside. <laughs> yeah, it's nighttime. Hmm. All right, let me find an empty bed here. All right. And it is sunrise. Look at that. Oh, they're all the way up there. Let's go up. Let's go up and see what there is to see up here. This is like one of the, one of the best uh, turnouts of a village. That I've had once, the, the, like I said, the one with the grandkids. I had, I had uh, mine, had uh, mine carts, <laughs> tracks all over the place. And... Be there. But yeah, this is one of the best. Oh, there's more carrots. Mind if I take a couple of these guys? And in fact. But that other uh, village years ago, or years ago, like last year, I had, I was trading carrots and wool with a, uh oh, I'm full again, let me get rid of something, it's all this, all this stone, I don't need all this stone. Get rid of some of those. Look out below. All right, now let's go back and get your carrots. I was trading carrots and potatoes and wool 
for emeralds. And then, of course, you can use the emeralds to buy the other things that you really need. But all the gardens. I had so many gardens. Hey, guys. Once there was one villager. Yes. How you doing? Alright. Let's go back down. doing you don't take the ladder you just float in midair there what's up with that what is going on there huh. looks like you're floating maybe you're not okay so we've had our final right here i wish there was a way to get a true count of how many villagers there are i know how i can estimate that but i'd like to get a true count Well, I think I only have one axe. I could use some more wood, but I don't want to get wood right now. What do I want to do? Oh, I think I want to take a break for a second here. LostTreasureHuntGame.com Thanks for uh, watching me here on the, in the, um, on the woodshed. That's my server. And for watching my YouTube channel. Very uh, pleased to see so many people subscribing. And um, I'm surprised. I mean, for this is just uh, me playing on a game, playing a game. It's really nothing too exciting. And so I'm really I really appreciate that someone um, finds it interesting enough to uh, to watch and and to sub subscribe. So thank you very much for that. I just started a Patreon. And uh, I'll have to put that in the uh, credits here. I didn't write it. This is an older slide here, so I don't have the, the link information on it. But um, appreciate it if you uh, want to throw a dollar my way. It'd be great. Um, that helps, you know, helps paying for the server and stuff like that. All right, back to it. Okay, so this is that village that's doing pretty well. It was prosperous, and it's nighttime, so I gotta watch out. Oh, I heard a creeper. Is it gonna be daylight pretty soon? What if I stand next to this guy? I'll be protected, right? Is that how it works? No, these are these guys afraid of creepers. Oh. Or you just don't want to stand next to me. Is that the deal? All right. So, LostTreasureHuntGame.com. That's where you go for information about this server and for information about the game. The game is for is finding lost treasure. Yeah, it's really not lost. It's buried. Buried treasure. There's coordinates at the website, and uh, you just match those coordinates up for an X marks the spot uh, oh, Reaper saw me and that way you journey you go on a journey once you find the coordinates for the where the treasure is yeah it's, but you can just play you can just play on the game on the uh, server it's the woodshed it's a vanilla minecraft um, in survival mode with claiming. Claiming is super important so you can you can claim an area to protect your stuff. So another player doesn't take it or you don't lose it if you get killed. Oh daylight or it's uh, sunrise. 
Sunrise is nice. Look at that. I like the colors. Colors are always nice in a sun sunrise. Yeah, look at that. All right, again, thank you for subscribing and giving me a thumbs up. Join my Discord as well. On the Discord, there are uh, some free downloads of builds from previous episodes. What do you need? You know, I think all you need is so um, world edit. place those builds into your uh, into your game onto your server and they were, again those builds were made to what is this oh is this the tunnel to the other side I can't remember yeah. those builds were made to uh, assist in growing out your um, villages takes me well, I know this takes me to the other village this is like almost the path of that little river that joins the two sides here although this is a straight line across what's in there mm, nothing. this was a straight line across but the oh I take that back it is an L shape That it was a straight line. Oh my God, this is a long way. Or did I just turn around and come back the exact same way I came? It wouldn't surprise me even one bit. Nope, this is this is the village. This is the village that had the one villager in it. Hey. Look at that, there's a Sherpa, uh, a, sh a herder up there with his um, llamas on top. How did they get, they must have come down. They must have come down from the top to get up there. Crazy. All right, good to see you guys. And thanks for watching. Another episode here of uh, Rampa Tony in Minecraft. Crazy as it sounds. Alright. Alright, thanks for watching. Once again, this was the woodshed. I'm Tony. And um, go to uh, lostreasurehuntgame.com for more information about the game. Uh, and just for the link to the. Um, Link to the uh, server here. There's that. There's that information there. Join the Discord. Get your free downloads of the builds from the previous game, previous episodes. Um, you got a spare dollar? <laughs> Go to my uh, new Patreon account, uh, and I'll put that in the in the information here. I haven't updated that slide right there yet. I gotta get. I gotta get to that. I got a lot of stuff I gotta do yet. Again, thanks a lot for watching, and we'll do some more Minecraft later. Thanks.